Bob Hubel definitely doesn't shit his pants. I don't know if that's the right that's, intro. Yeah, that's all. Yeah, that's. I want to make sure people know that we have a lot of people watching right now. You don't shit your pants. So, Rob, hmm. I don't know if you're like me, but I watch TikTok, I watch Instagram, and then there are these like life hacks that I'm always trying to remember. It's like, don't put your lemons in uh, the refrigerator, yeah. get yeah. a bucket of water and put them in there and they stay fresh. Yeah, so, or... right, so we just started doing that. My wife like puts our fruit in a bucket for like a couple hours. I don't know why. But... It, there's a lot of things that I'm doing. It's like, oh, you're putting your trash can, uh, your trash bags in wrong. Oh, you're yeah. doing, everything is to tell me that I'm doing it wrong. It's like, you're <laughs> yeah. washing that wrong. And then I'm like, okay, now yeah. I'm trying to remember. I got to get baking soda and I'm getting a lemon. Yeah. And then this guy is like growing a pineapple out of yeah. a seed. Anyway, I saw this life hack and I immediately thought of you because I know uh, how you feel about airplane travel. And I thought this is a great airplane travel life hack about how you can uh, kind of an easier flight. Okay. Molly? No. About this amazing hack, you can bring coconuts on the airplane. So I don't like to drink water in airports. Ugh. Can't get water through security. But. You can bring coconut water on the airplane in a coconut. Coconut water is a great source of magnesium, manganese, all kinds of good stuff. So oh, about 10, 10 coconuts in there that I'm going to have to drink on this plane. And I've got meat. So I got some burgers, heart burgers, regular burgers that I'm bringing on the plane. So that's how I travel. In case you guys didn't know. I'm, I'm already furious. I'm furious. Well, one, I'm furious that your algorithm is feeding you that guy and you have to, <laughs> I feel bad for you. But like, what, who? <sighs> he brought 10 coconuts. How are you going to open them? <laughs> what are you going to smash them together? Like who's sitting next to this guy that's like. And how much juice is in a coconut? Like I've every time not, I've opened a coconut, much. it's not, not much. that much. It's not much. And he's like, and I he don't like drink a bucket. He has a bucket of meat of just fucking beef that like who's sitting next burger to this guy heart? it's gonna be shitting his pants in no time i would rather sit next to the dude who brings a full-on burrito onto the plane than the guy breaking his own coconuts to get like an ounce of water in there and here's the other thing he says it like i don't like drinking airport water as if that's the only choice you can't buy water at the airport god oh god you can't buy water at the airport like yeah then like the flight attendants aren't more than happy to give you as much water as you want like there's never been a case where you're like oh, oh, oh I'm just, i can't it's not like I'm they're pulling just... it out of the toilet i mean like you're going into an air like the idea that he has packed 10 baby uh... coconuts and you know he's so psyched to like be like Oh, what are you doing? Oh, I don't drink water. I uh, I drink my coconuts. Oh, uh, that's what it is. That's what it is. It's a it's a it's a that's a single guy trying to meet people. And, that is and, the carrying. Oh, coconuts. you should. Oh, you should follow me on Instagram. I'm like a life hack guy. I'd be like, oh fuck. I would open the emergency door and let him get. I'd be like, everybody, buckle up now. Open it. Let him get the, sucked out. Let him get sucked out the window. And here's the other thing. Bringing coconuts onto an airplane is the equivalent of like having a snake around your neck. It's like, it's just begging people to talk to you. It's like, let me, let me tell you about my coconuts. Um, Wait, now I, I have I, to, I, I have to send, I didn't know we were going to be talking about, uh, by the way, what, what do you think my, my opinion of airline travel is? I, I do. I, I don't know. know. I was just trying to give us a nice clean setup. I was trying to like okay. set the table for, uh, okay, you know. got, Molly, I'm sending you one, Molly, I'm sending one to friend zone on Instagram of a flight <laughs> attendant that I, I love this flight attendant. Um, this is not the sexual flight attendant, is it? No, no, no. This is a, a woman on air Jamaica who is beautiful. Uh, but that's okay. the point. And, um, but just has the funniest like reprimand for passengers who I'm surprised that she can be so outspoken about idiot passengers on her flight, but she's just like taking people to task. I, M Molly will show it in a second, but um, I, uh, I am, I don't again. I don't know why I get certain things in my feed, but I have this one. I'm going to send this to Molly. I have this one person that has popped up in my feed uh, all the time. Yeah, I'm going to just. I'm just going to send it to Molly, and Molly, you can deem whether or not it's inappropriate or not. But I think my. Go. I think. Oh, you know, this. Yeah, this girl's great. 
Okay, that's okay, good. Here we go. Good morning, Jamaicans. Good morning, or good evening, good night, good afternoon, wherever you guys are. Nobody's going to say it to you. So I am going to help you guys out, okay? Stop coming on the aircraft where people wear this blue and this orange color uniform and arguing with them about a completely different company. Stop arguing with them about Air Jamaica. Air Jamaica is gone. Air Jamaica is no more. You're not coming back. Stop telling me that you need mackerel and liver and dumpling and callaloo and breadfruit and all the other stuff that Air Jamaica used to serve. This is not Air Jamaica. <laughs> this company served snacks. This is what the snacks look like. This is the menu card. Get familiar with it. Get familiar with this thing in the seat back pocket. We serve these things. They're called snacks. Jamaicans, you like to call it dry food. There is no cook food on this plate. <laughs> we don't have any mackerel. We don't have any liver. We don't have any dumpling. Nothing like that. Stop it. We don't want to fight with me over what I tell you I have. Oh, I don't know what kind of play in this. I don't know what kind of play in this. I don't know what kind of play in this. I don't Yes. Eat a yard. I'm sorry. Goodbye. Jeez. I Are all the videos kind of setting us straight about Air Jamaica not existing anymore? Um, no. I went to her page and she, you know, some of it is her on the plane. And uh, I think they've just kind of like let, because she's so good at it, they've just like let her do her will thing. Will they let her, will they let her bring coconuts on? Like, can she, <laughs> did she talk about the coconuts? By the way, someone uh, posted here, uh, Maja Cat, I believe, posted this. I want to just read it here. Um, coconuts are prohibited on flights due to their high oil content, which makes them a potential fire hazard. The ban extends to uh, the copra, copra, the dry coconut meat, given its heightened flammability. However, there are exceptions for retail packaged coconut products that are sealed and deemed for transport. So that guy's yeah. in for a rude awakening. That guy, he's going to be detained. 